Elbit Systems announced on June 14 that it was awarded an additional contract by Airbus Helicopters for the Federal Office for Bunswear Equipment, Information Technology and In-Service Support, for the provision of Airborne Electronic Warfare EW, self-protection systems for the Sikorsky CH-53GS GEC Stallion Transport Helicopters, as part of the platform upgrade program led by Airbus Helicopters. Under the contract, Elbit Systems, supported by Elbit Systems Deutschland, will provide digital radar warning receivers, RWR, EW controllers, EWC, and countermeasure dispensing systems, CMDS. The digital RWR and EWC rapidly detect and accurately locate a wide range of threats, even in a dense EW environment, enabling reliable and timely warning and effective protection. The systems feature complete and independent threat programmability, enabling the seamless update of emitter libraries as well as flight data recording for pilot debriefing and training. Coupled with the CMDS the entire system provides the German Air Force with a high level of operational effectiveness. Oren Sabag, General Manager, Elbit Systems Istar and EW, we are proud to cooperate with Airbus helicopters and appreciate the trust that the German Air Force places in our leading technologies that will continue to provide enhanced survivability and to increase mission effectiveness. In 1966, the German Army evaluated both the CH-53 and CH-47 Chinook as a replacement for the H-21 and H-34G helicopters with an initial requirement for 133. The purchase of the CH-53 was approved in June 1968, but due to budget constraints, only 110 were ordered. Following the delivery in 1969 of two pre-production helicopters from Sikorsky, the production aircraft were license-built by VFW Fokker at Speyer in Germany. The first German-built CH-53 G Mittelrad transport Hubschrauber helicopter flew from Speyer on of October 1971, and was delivered to the Erprobungstelle der Bundeswehr 61 Flight Test Center at Manching on 1 December, 1971. The German Army Aviation Corps received 110 Type CH-53 GS, derivatives of the CH. 53D, between 1971 and 1975. 108 helicopters were built in Germany by VFW Fokker. The first flight by a German CH 53G was made in 1971, followed in March 1973 by the delivery of the first machines to Heeres Flieger Regiment, HFLGRGT, Army Aviation Corps Regiment, 35 in Mendig, and shortly afterward to the newly formed Army Aviation Corps Regiment 15 based at Rhein and Army Aviation Corps Regiment 25 based at Lorfheim. In order to meet ever more demanding specifications, over time the CH-53G received modifications from 1990 design to improve its service life and operational capabilities. These involved three major upgrades, new missile warning and self-protection systems, provision for two external fuel tanks allowing the range to be increased to 1,100 miles, 1,800 kilometers, when carrying 36 armed soldiers or a 12,100 pounds, 5,500 kilograms payload, an addition of a night vision goggles compatible cockpit for night low-level flying capabilities. All CH-53GS were upgraded by Eurocopter Germany by early 2001, resulting in updated GS, GE EGA variants. As a result of foreign military operations, 20 CH-53G helicopters were converted to perform combat search and rescue CSAR, missions. Version CH-53GS is equipped with modernized IFR equipment, additional exterior fuel tanks, low-flight night vision cockpit and NVG, partial ballistic protection, engine dust collectors, missile countermeasures, and self-defense armament. Additionally, the original engines were replaced by the more powerful T-64-100 engines. German Army Aviation Corps units have carried out a wide range of international missions under the auspices of NATO and the UN, providing transport for members of UNSCOM in Iraq, serving in Kosovo with KFOR, with IFAR in Bosnia and Herzegovina, and more recently with ISAF in Afghanistan. On 1 January 2013, all Army Aviation Corps CH-53 GS were transferred to the German Air Force and incorporated into Helicopter Wing 64. During the 2010s, Germany was reportedly considering options for replacing its aging CH-53 G fleet, with candidates including the Chinook and the CH-53 K model. On 29 September 2020, the German Ministry of Defense cancelled the Schwerer Transport Hubschrauber STH. 
heavy lifting helicopter program for 45 to 60 helicopters after the initiative was judged to be too expensive and stated that its CH-53 GS fleet would be replaced following a period of re-examination. In 2022, the federal government announced that all of Germany's CH-53s would be replaced by 60 CH-47F Chinooks.